The Virtual Brain Tool Suite is a large open source ecosystem with an end-to-end -end workflow for creating personalized brain network models and simulating them. It is now available on the European Brain Research Infrastructures, or eBrains Cloud. The Virtual Brain on eBrains, or TVB on eBrains, allows users to construct, simulate, and analyze personalized brain network models. Its powerful features can be used from your local computer, making computationally expensive neurological research possible from the comfort of your web browser. The virtual brain integration in eBrains allows users to have an end-to-end -end experience of personalized brain model creation and multi-scale brain simulation using high-performance computing in the cloud. This makes it possible to process large cohort databases, which in turn makes it possible to produce generalized results. This is a precondition for being able to use these results to develop potential medical treatments, therapies, or diagnostic procedures. The Virtual Brain on eBrain's ecosystem software is open source. The software is distributed in the form of execution-ready Docker containers that can be pulled from Docker Hub. The containers can be executed on supercomputers using secure container environments like Saris or Shifter. Jupyter Notebooks enable users to operate the containers on supercomputers directly from their web browser. TVB on eBrains includes a variety of simulation tools, pipelines, and datasets which we will introduce in the course of this video. Let's start with the Virtual Brain Cloud Simulator. The Virtual Brain Cloud Simulator is a neuroinformatics platform for simulating and analyzing large-scale brain network dynamics based on biologically realistic connectivity. The Virtual Brain simulations produce typical neuroimaging signals like local field potentials, electroencephalograms, magnetoencephalograms, electrocorticograms, and functional magnetic resonance images for individualized brain models. The TVB graphical interface can be accessed in the browser. Using the web app, you can configure simulations that are either processed directly on the web server or on a supercomputer, depending on the complexity of what you want to achieve. This makes resource-heavy simulation accessible to researchers that don't have access to supercomputers. You can access these tools with an eBrains user account. TVB can also be operated programmatically using Python code. To help you get started, Jupyter Notebooks that introduce you to the TVB simulators are available on the eBrains Collaboratory platform. By following a series of examples, you can perform your first brain simulation in the cloud. The Virtual Brain Simulator software has many possible applications. For example, it is currently being put to test in a multi-center clinical trial in France for its potential to help pre-surgical planning in patients with epilepsy. The TVB Brain Image Processing Pipeline extracts structural and functional connectomes from raw MRI data to personalize brain models. The data that is outputted by the pipeline is ready to use in the virtual brain. You can conveniently operate the pipeline from eBrain's collaboratory. The computationally heavy work is done using a backend of supercomputers. The TVB pipeline both inputs and outputs data that complies to the BID standard, Brain Imaging Data Structure. You can find MRI data to feed into the pipeline using the eBrain's knowledge graph. All software and datasets in the virtual brain ecosystem are registered and annotated in the knowledge graph to make them easier to locate and use. Following a Jupyter Notebook, you can find out how to upload that data to the eBrain's drive, how to process it on the supercomputer in the background, and finally, how to retrieve the results ready for use in the TVB simulation. The output from the pipeline is annotated according to the MINDS format using JSON LD schemas. This means once they are ingested into eBrains, they are findable and reusable via the eBrains knowledge graph. To run the processing pipelines on a supercomputer, you will need a dedicated HPP supercomputing account, which will allow you to use the Phoenix Computing Resources. You can apply for this from ICEI, Interactive Computing E-Infrastructure. Alternatively, you can also download and execute the pipeline containers on your local computer or on other high-performance computers. TVB Multiscale Co-Simulation is a Python toolbox that enables you to simulate multiscale networks. Multiscale networks simulate both activity on the coarse scale and activity on a finer scale. In its current form, TVB Multiscale Co-Simulation is a Python wrapper for the Virtual Brain Neuroinformatics Platform and the Nest Spiking Network Simulator. TVB simulates on the macroscopic scale of brain regions. Nest, on the other hand, simulates on the mesoscopic scale of small neural populations or the microscopic scale of individual neurons. 
You can use the TVB Multiscale Co simulation either as a web application or you can download it and run it locally in a Docker container. Just like the TVB simulator, TVB Multiscale Co simulation can be run on supercomputer resources with an eBrains account. TVB and TVB Multiscale Simulator is GPL v3 licensed and developed according to agile software development methodologies with frequent releases and updates. Fast TVB provides fast and parallelizable hardware near implementations of selected TVB models containerized for direct use on eBrains. It is thousands of times faster than Python TVB. Fast TVB uses multiple optimization techniques and is written in the hardware near language C. In addition, FastTVB makes it possible to simulate in parallel. Users can specify how many threads will simultaneously perform the processing and occupy multiple processors. The containerized FastTVB image can be conveniently run using Docker, Shifter, or Singularity without the need to install dependencies or to build the software from the source code. FastTVB's high-performance simulation code is ideal for computationally expensive operations for example, performing a dense perimeter space exploration or simulating high-dimensional models with more than 1,000 network nodes. TVB, TVB Pipeline, and FastTVB have already been successfully used in publications that were included in high-impact peer-reviewed journals such as eLife, NeuroImage, NeuroImage Clinical, and eNeuro. Researchers have used FastTVB, for example, to tackle questions on multiscale mechanisms in the brains of healthy humans and patients with brain tumors or neurodegenerative diseases. The FastTVB eBrains Collaboratory will guide you through the process of using the FastTVB container on supercomputer backends with a Jupyter Notebook as the front end. TVB on eBrains ecosystem also provides you with reference data sets that are ready to use in the virtual brain. These datasets are provided in the BIDS format and can be found using the eBrains knowledge graph. The datasets contain all information required to build virtual brains. As an example, one dataset contains TVB-ready data with the structural and functional connectomes of 31 patients with brain tumors and 11 healthy controls. An advanced use of TVB is a specification of disease models. This has been done, for example, by augmenting TVB with the patient's positron emission tomography, or PET, data. You can follow extensive tutorials walking you through the approaches used in TVB publications in TVB's International Neuroinformatics Coordinating Facility, or INCF, training space. The dedicated TVB INCF training space provides didactic use cases, Jupyter notebooks, video tutorials, and example datasets to get you up to speed. Educational case studies demonstrate, for example, how to use TVB via the collaboratory of the Human Brain Project, how to run multi-scale co-simulations with other simulators such as Nest, and how to process imaging data to construct personalized virtual brains of healthy individuals and patients. In summary, the virtual brain ecosystem on eBrains contains the virtual brain simulator that can be used in the cloud with a supercomputing backend, ready-to-use pipelines to build personalized brains that enable users to process their own imaging data or shared data with large cohorts. TVB-ready imaging datasets of patients and healthy controls discoverable via eBrains. The TVB Multiscale Co-Simulation web application, which enables co-simulating some brain regions at a finer scale using the Nest simulator. Fast and parallelizable hardware near implementations of TVB models containerized for direct use on eBrains via CoLab Notebooks. The INCF training space, with a dedicated area for the virtual brain, where a rich multitude of didactic use cases are available with video tutorials, Jupyter Notebooks, and example datasets. The code for all projects is open source and available for download. All required software is implemented as standalone and cross-platform containers. This means you can easily run it on your system of choice with all dependencies automatically installed for you. Workflows are versioned and previous versions remain available so you can exactly reproduce past work. Interoperability with other neuroimaging software has been prioritized. The TVB pipeline outputs and inputs BIDS format. Output is annotated according to the MINDS format so it can be directly ingested into the knowledge graph where all software and datasets in the virtual brain ecosystem are registered and annotated, making them easier to locate and use. The tools are functional and have already been used in publications in high-impact peer-reviewed journals.
All the software required for brain simulation is in one place, and you can be the next user.